Bonsoir. We are not. Thank you. We were having a, a rally in the park and there were hundreds of people. We really got the truck, the crowd all, all worked up and it was wonderful. And, and at the end of the rally, we were packing up chairs and he said, packing up chairs with us and he said, this is what I want to do. And I said, well, you're actually already doing it by being in the office every day and doing the things that you do. But if, if this is what you want to do for your, as your life, that's certainly something that you should consider. Because he was very natural at it. He had a very good understanding of what people wanted and needed. Jakobus that I saw the first day he walked into our offices. And the person that I saw literally a week before he died were very, very different. Um, they had so transformed into the most beautiful, most powerful, incredibly articulate activist. The gods fashioned you a heart of ruby, designed to be encased behind the ribs, protected, but you chose to wear it on your sleeve, bright and bold for all to admire. It matched your lipstick and shone as brightly as your smile, rivaled your impeccable style. Strong as the gem it was sculpted from, you wore it into battle, wielding your intelligence like metal fortified, and side by side with peers from far and wide, you took down fear. You struck down ignorance. You shook up hate. I have here on my immediate left Jacobus Whitmore, a very young but very capable person and, and, and gorgeous. Gorgeous, yeah. Jacobus joined us in 2015, joined Pan Africa Ilga in 2015. For a young person, he had done quite a lot. He threw himself into this work. He, he gave it all to basically bring in that youthful voice. I remember just recently when he wanted to go to the Gambia, he did an excellent job. Essentially, for me, I have lost a lot more than just a colleague. I've lost a friend. I've lost someone that I, I depended on. Wherever he is, wherever you are, Jacob, uh, you know, we'll do everything. We are going to fight with everything we've got to make sure that Pan Africa Ilga continues the work that you started. Pan Africa Ilga grows and in your honor, just, you know, we can in five years time celebrate Pan Africa Ilga in your honor and say, this is what you started and this is where we are today. The board has been greatly affected. The staff have been greatly affected. And personal have been greatly affected because I was very close to him. The memory that I have of Jacobus is the person that was dedicated to his duty, the person that respected people around him, uh, the person that knew his boundaries. And it's very hard to deal with people, to deal with boards, to deal with other staff, to deal with other colleagues. And I was so privileged to know him because he did it so well and at ease. And I think for me that's the memory. And him being our first staff at Pi, I think he's left a big hole. And it doesn't matter who come and fill up the position. It doesn't matter how long that will take. Jacobus's memory will still live in the, in the organization. It doesn't matter whether I'm still on the board or not, because I'll personally and together with the board ensure that his memory lives on forever in various things that we shall do as Pi. There was just something about Jacobus which was quite unarming, very humble and very gentle, but more than anything else, it was his eagerness, you know, to learn. He was extremely sweet, you know, well, he called everyone sweetie. 
Uh, but he was a very gentle person. He was also extremely, extremely humble, you know, as a human being. And I think that's what made him so endearing. What everyone remembers about Jacobus is how engaged and engaging, you know, he was. So those were the impressions that we had of him. Jacobus, who was a new person in this kind of regional human rights work scene, had come in with such a lot of promise and to be so tragically taken away, you know, from us at the nascent, you know, of his kind of regional and international career. We need to be more present for each other. You see such splendor, you see such happiness, you see such beauty, you see such diversity. And then you understand and you feel the worth of the effort that has gone into it. Show some love. Show some love. Through your armor shone warmth. Through your eyes, kindness. We carry the flame in the name of comrades fallen but not lost. Jacobus, you leave a ruby trail in your wake. <laughs>